Houston. I love to come through, say what's up to Chris, owner of R uh, RST, and he always wants to eat. Luckily, I fasted like I was supposed to, so it was actually time for me to eat, so I'm not mad at that. Just ran into Cody, works for US Express, said he met Shooter Brown as well. That's great. We're gonna go over to the dealership, and we're gonna see what the dealership has in store. what Chris has been ordering. The phone. Globe Trotter. It's a pretty nice truck, Chris. Manager, so it looks good. It does. Does um, can we open it? Yeah, he's got a customer's office. But once he oh. Gets done, you know how they're all hinged release? Yeah. They, so when you lay them down, they put chain hangers right here, so they don't fall. So no, so you can hang your your snow chains, and oh. then you cover it up. That is hot. It's right behind the dev tank. Yeah. Yeah, those chains get caped up with stuff and all that. And then they're out of the slipstream. Yeah, this is a, this is a globe charter. I thought you said it wasn't gonna be um. These are the two that came in that oh. you did it. The one that Matt is in. It was either this one or one that Matt says the one you filmed. It's a nice one, man. This is nice. I gotta. I'm gonna say I never liked Volvos. I've always liked Volvo. It's just been a thing of mine. So I'm gonna sit in this one real quick. Chris is trying to get me to get one. All right, right now we are sitting in the Volvo 860, is it? Man, some serious room in this thing, dude. Oh, this seat feels good, man. I'm not gonna lie to you about that. Yeah, see, this is as nice as the ones that we order. We have the gauges here, we got the leather out steering wheel, the parking position. Man, it's still more buttons that could have went in here. Yeah, a lot of more buttons. I think we have a, another set of gauges right here. Oh. Um, so I think the, the whole, you're gonna do the whole fleet Volvo? Well, see, we're liking them so far. You know, you're not gonna we'll think have of- six in the fleet by the end of the year. You're not thinking of switching to like uh, Peterbilt or uh, Kenworth or- We won't buy any more Kenworths. Really? What's your thought process on that? The ones that we have have been our biggest problems. I didn't say that. Did you hear what they just said? All Peter Bilts and Kenworth suck. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't gonna say it, dude, but Chris came out and got controversial. It's the truth is the truth, dude. It is what you it is. You're Peter Bilts. I mean, Pete's are nice, dude. I'm not I always, you know, fool with the Pete guys. Logo feces. What's that? They have logo feces everywhere in the Peter Bilts. Yeah, and that's the thing, it's embroidered all up in here, all up down there. You know, I, I, I enjoyed the 379 I drove in the oil field. It was nice. Well, you know what, I didn't, um, I just don't like to be that close. Yeah. To, you know, like, you can just touch the door. That's a little much for me, but other than that, I, I enjoyed it, you know. Let's see what the over the hood looks like in this thing. You know? It's over the hood, man. Let's take a look around. Alrighty. Really? This is a thing? Refrigerator. The refrigerator is huge, man. I guess this is the, the fr 
freezer here. <laughs> Yo, that is a lot of room. Close her back up. And this goes in here like, uh, like so. Oh yeah. Uh, I don't wanna break up. Oh, you gotta hit the button first. Uh, nice little fish. First of all, not big enough for my TV. Let's get that out the way. Compartments in here. Nice, and even if you don't want to climb. Sorry, Chris. Ooh, yeah. Step up the ladder, lay it down. Nice overhead space. Chris says I should get one. Turn in dirty red and get one of these. Maybe. <laughs> Isn't hinged, dude. Well, that's an issue already, buddy. Maybe, dude. Maybe. I just love coming to the Vanguard place, man. They always have something that I'm not expecting to see. Like, like this right here. Some mini little super sleeper situation here. Class B. But they still have other trucks around here that aren't the brand new ones, you know. They still have the, um, you know, the uh, 760s around here too. I, for some reason, I am in love with the mid-roof 760. I love it. I don't know why. I just think it looks, it looks like a sports car. See? Tell me that don't look like a sports car. A sports car to me. Yeah. Yeah. Can't get in this puppy. Vanguard Volvo. They don't want you sitting in regular seats. They want you sitting in leather seats. Look at this. With carbon fiber tables on them. Fancy. The actual, this is the actual RST model that uh, that we're running, but I think the new one's gonna be a little bit different, but let's take a look inside. So is this the, uh, is this gonna be the RST model or? Yes, this is. This is the RST interior package. Okay, I see now you have the gauges over here on the RST one. Gauge package, wheel cover package. Comes right with it. Comes with our package. Keyless entry. Oh, oh okay. Look at that. <laughs> That's nice. That's nice right there. All right. Now, you got the only thing that we don't get is the lane departures cameras. So no. we do have blind spot monitors. So does that mean it's going to go yin, 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 yin? Is, you know, the annoying loud one? That's, that's pretty good. There's turn signal on and try to move in the blind spot. The truck honks its horn on the inside. It honks its horn it's on the inside. Mini, and this thing lights up bright red. Oh. It's like you've got a die light. <laughs> I like the little, little, little edge. Up. Yeah, see, I told you some better shape than the other one. I don't know, man. I mean, you you know, you, you have a hard pitch here, uh, Chris. Seats are heated and air conditioned. Really? Yeah. I'm trying to fall out of this thing. Mother fudger. I'm really, really struggling to find elementary school kids trying to get this back. I'm really struggling to find words to use instead of cuss words. <laughs> this is terrible to do. It's terrible. Okay, so you got up and down. You got this sliding situation. Oh, I guess this is an independent up and down. Holy crap, look at all these buttons in the back here. 
and then it's got position perfect steering. If you go halfway down on the pedal, the neck bends. Wow, that is fancy. Running lights, but battery's off. Oh, battery's off. See hey, Chris Elliott real quick. He showed me some new stuff on the engine. He wasn't necessarily uh, caught up on it yet, so he's gonna let me know when he gets this new secret truck in. When he gets that one in, I'm gonna come in. I'm gonna review that one, or he's gonna explain it to me. Bad ass here. I and I'm gonna get to the hotel room. They said they considered it smoking. 